Alright, ladies and gentlemen, are we ready to rock the socks off of the Rockets tonight? I know I am. Time for Game 10 of our Backyard Baseball League play. Last game was absolutely legendary. Best game we've done thus far. If you haven't checked that out, you absolutely should. It was really, really good. Anyhow, time for Game 10 today. We're up against the first team we played against, the Rockets, who have not been doing terribly well. This, I'm pretty confident we can beat them this time. Also, Tony, I'm not going to say Tony completely redeemed himself last game, but Tony did good last game. And I'm thinking maybe he needs more positive encouragement, and that's really all. Maybe he's been playing badly, because I've been saying he's been playing badly. Or maybe not, we'll just have to wait and see. Anyhow, here's my lineup. I think I'm going to change the batting order. And the reason for that is... Lisa has been a really bad batter. I'm going to move her farther down the batting order so she doesn't actually get at bat as often. I think this looks like a bit of a better batting lineup. We'll see how it works. I think if Lisa and Tony get <laughs> appear at bat less, that would be for the best. Because, boy, howdy, they, their, their batting records are not very good. Anyhow, the rest of the team is just fine. So, without further ado, Artie's All-Stars rematch against the Rockets. Let's go. It's time for another game of the most exciting baseball around. I'm Sunny Day, and joining me is my pal, Vinny the Gooch. Together, we'll bring you every bit of the action. What she means is, she's never gonna stop yapping. It's my job, Vinny. Going head-to-head -head in today's game are the Blue Rockets and the Junior All-Stars. This has been quite an exciting season for these kids, and the All-City BBL playoffs are in sight. These kids should be very proud of their performance so far. They've played hard, and it's paid off. And now it's time for the action to begin. Okay, you kooky fans, give us a cheer for your favorite baseball team, the All-Stars. Woo! I love how we're going against the Blue Rockets and their purple. And we're the real blue team? That's funny. All right, let's beat the pants off them. On the mound today is Lisa Crockett. If it curves or catches fire, Mad Dog can throw the heck out of it. Just don't ask her to throw a slow ball. Watch me now. Hey, <laughs> hey Sonic, right yes, we are. <laughs> we are going to get to Team Rocket beginning. of a sorts. <laughs> Not that Team Rocket, though. All right. The Rockets actually got a couple points on me last time we played, but I've improved since then. So we're not going to let that happen again, are we? No siree. No siree. <laughs> yeah, Brett. Feel breeze from that one over here. Bet the battle wasn't expecting that. Let's get Brett Olson out. He ain't going to hit this. Good. First, first person up at bat, and we get a strikeout. This is off to a promising start. Oh, I remember Wien Kwan. No relation to Michelle Kwan. I like the snazzy purple uh, outfits. Oh, and right to Kenny. Wow, Kenny didn't get it. Dude, why in the world would you ever try to go to second when you're up against the Petrovich? Yeah, you're out. Get out of here. You barely made it to first, and you tried to go to second? Are you crazy? Our kids are great. They, they, they're they're going to shut that down real fast. All right, let's get Chrissy out, and then we can get up at that. You're going to... Oh, no. No, you're not going to get away with that. You're not going to get away with that. <laughs> and Dimitri pulls his signature move. Catches, then throws it out of play because there's nobody on base. <laughs> Way to go, Dimitri. Oh, boy. Now pitching Wing Kwan. He's been known to pull a radical pitch out of his sleeve from time to time. So we just may see a monkey ball or a scrambler today. I wouldn't bet on it. All right, Pete. You know what we're going to do. We're going to do classic bunt. Uh, what am I supposed to do again? Pete, all you have to do is stick out the baseball bat and make contact with the ball. That's literally it. Not for that one. Not for that one. We're going to wait for a better pitch. Into the wind oh. the delivery. Just like the that. Wing. Beautiful, Pete. Beautiful. Run fast. 
Gotta go fast. Yeah. All right. Nice job, Pete. Time for everyone's favorite handicapped kid, Kenny Kawaguchi. There I go. Kenny, what's your speed like today? Are you fast? I hope you're fast, because we're gonna go line drive. He's ready now. Unfortunately, Sonic, only about two of my kids on the team know how to go fast. Pete Wheeler and, ironically, Kenny Kawaguchi. All my other kids are slow as slugs. From the wind up, he throws it. Not swinging. Ball one, one and one. Actually, no, I'm gonna go grounder with Kenny. I find grounder, grounder with Kenny tends to work out more often than not. I'm not swinging. I'm not swinging. <laughs> Those, they must be Mario fans. Mario can go fast too, just not as fast. From the stretch and deliver. Swing. No, like Left, these these kids are like five, Earthworm Jim fans in terms of speed. <laughs> or Sonic from Sonic Labyrinth. That's from more appropriate. Two, two, nice grounder. All right. Oh, ball. forgot to make Pete steal, but that's okay. Rollers. Try to get Pete out. Nope, they're gonna try to get Kenny out. And Darn it. Okay. We've still got a chance to score in this inning. Let's do Dana it! and Kenny was pretty fast, too. Yeah, they were just a little Even fast. All right. All right. We Pablo. all know he's a rad dude. Mandame una buena. All right. Mi amigo, Pablo Sanchez. Better, better. Let's hit this one out of the park. He winds and delivers. Swing. Darn it. A bouncing ball. That little blooper sent him running. Oops. The wheels fell off. This is quite a predicament. Oops! The wheels fell off. He's out. Okay. Not to let an out shake a lot just happened there. A. How did I not get out when I was on base? And B. Pete decided to run off the base again and get out. What? I I have no words. I have no words. Into the motion and the throw. Nope. That was a ball. Runner on first, two out. Keisha, can you redeem uh, Pete's error? From the stretch and the delivery. A swing, strike one. Should have let that one go. One and one. Thanks, Vinny. I'm not very good at identifying what's in the strike zone or not. Here's the motion. Nope. Pitch on the way. Nope. Nope. That was ball two. Nope. Not swinging at that. Waiting for one right down the middle. Right down the middle. I'm not swinging. Please walk, Keisha Phillips. Please walk her. I changed my batting order so I don't even have Lisa Crockett up next. Nope, not swinging. That was a strike! <laughs> Hi, Marty. You thought the pitcher was Kane Khan? That would have been a lot harder to deal with. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Please don't kick that because they never feel they don't make any fielding errors I thought that was out of the park for a second there and that'll do it in the first inning one left on I'd be in even bigger trouble if it was Kane calm we need Sunohara Sunohara wasn't that great at baseball no, no we, we need Tomoyo from the wind up the delivery the swing oh yes a bouncing ball can he get that and bada bing bada boom? Nice job, Dimitri. Or Akio. We never really got to see how good Akio was other than his pitching, though. Star Moonbeam has got to be one of the coolest names. Bam! Lisa doesn't even care. I literally didn't even move the mouse for that. Lisa did that all on her own. <laughs> How, why would you make fun of a name like Star Moonbeam? That's the, like one of the coolest names ever. Pablo, please don't drop this. Jumping in the air. <laughs> we again, Lisa refuses to let her teammates to, refuses to trust her teammates to do anything. <laughs> She's like, Pablo, you're gonna drop it. I'm taller than you. I'm gonna catch it for you. Halfway through the inning now. Also, as you can see, Marty, I switched up my batting order a bit. I moved Lisa back to the <laughs> the end of the lineup with Tony. Yeah, Lisa, Lisa sucks at batting, but Dane, she's like a one-woman fielder. From the stretch and the throw. Swinging. And pop. Well, that's an out. Unless they bump into each other. 
Oh my gosh. Jorge Garcia got to the phone first. Nice. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Win Quan's having a bad day, folks. <laughs> Oh boy, Dimitri, I could go for a deep into the outfield line drive here, but I'm going to hit power. I've got it out this pitcher, so I know what throws are coming. Target goes up the pitch. Swung on, strike one. Runner on first, nobody out. Dimitri, we got we got to work on this a little bit. No, no, no okay. Let that one go, Dimitri. <laughs> That one's just Tyreen Wien Quan out. Here's the wind up, the 1 1 pitch. A swing. And a foul ball. And the count is 1 and 2. We want a batter, not a Takes the stretch, the 1 2 pitch. One on. Darn it, Dimitri, come on, stop hitting foul. That was a beautiful right down the middle slow ball. You easily could have hit that. The wind up, the delivery. Swung on. Darn it. A bouncing ball. That's a double play. Gotta watch your kneecaps on those tails. He's out of there. And it's a long walk back to the dugout. He's out. Okay. We've there was no point in going back. That would have just inning. tired him Let's out and he wouldn't it. have gone. He wouldn't have been safe anyways. Justin All right, just send him. Watch this. Home run. Hey, better, better, better. Your theme song is cool, but <laughs> will it actually play? Nice sideways hit. And a foul ball. I think that would have been a pop fly even if it wasn't two foul, out. so that's now fine. Pitching. Wow, Win Quan didn't even last two innings. They had to get Whitney on instead. All right, power squared. Old standby. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. From the wind up, the 1 1 pitch. The swing. That's a nice hit, Josie. To the outfield, don't catch that. Oh my god. Doggone it! They never drop anything. Even when they drop it, they still catch it. And that'll close up the second. No score in this one so far. Judy Abunza. Oh boy. Fun times in. <laughs> Fun times at the at the parks department field number two. Alright, well, I'm not worried. You can't get past the wall, Lisa Crockett. A bouncing ball down the middle. Literally the only three The only three people I really need in the field are Lisa Crockett, Dimitri Petrovich, and Pete Wheeler for outfield. Other than that, like none of my other characters do anything. Oh, I guess mm, never mind. Jorge also occasionally helps out. But like, Pablo doesn't do anything. Jocinda doesn't do anything. Tony has done nothing. Keisha's barely done anything. I guess Kenny can help if like they bunt. But I like Lisa has single-handedly saved her. But try this at home, kids. The vast majority of the time. That was a ball. One and one. Yeah, hard mode. They're not. They're not kidding around with hard mode. The stretch. The delivery. Hit hard. Boom. Lisa does not care. Oh boy. So we got our weak batters and Pete Wheeler. I'm expecting Lisa to strike out because she always does. Tony. But realistically, Tony's either going to get out or he's going to get a home run. Like, he very rarely gets out. Every time. Here goes nothing. Regardless, I'm, I'm thinking we're going to have to hit power with Pete. Takes the stretch, throws it. The wing. And a Lisa. Nobody out. Lisa, like, just physically can't hit anything but a foul. The target goes up, throws it. I'd actually put her down there for one of the worst batters in the game, which is saying something, because you're, you're up against, like, Vicky Kawaguchi, uh, Ricky Johnson, Gretchen Hasselhoff, Reese Worthington. From the line up, a 1-1 one, one pitch. A swing. Okay. A that was not a line drive. That was a grounder. Too slow to be able to reach first base. That's fine. You're good enough at fielding that I don't even mind. All right, Tony. Tony? The strongest kid on the team. 
It's okay if you don't get out. I just want you to do your best. Maybe get a base hit. I believe in you, Tony. I think the positive encouragement wasn't working out so well. All you can do is try your hardest. Tony Brother. Spend more time on the, focusing on the ball, less time I'm on sucking that lollipop. Touchdown. Yes, Pete. We, we're all waiting for the touchdown. Target goes up. The delivery. Nope. Strike one, two out. Don't. I challenge that call, but whatever. The target goes up. And the offering. Another strike. From the wind up and the offering. <laughs> I don't know how the physics on that work, but okay. At least it wasn't a strikeout. From the stretch and the delivery. A swing. Okay, that that's foul. What? And they're probably gonna catch Oh my what the heck? Star Moonbeam is as fast as a moonbeam. I think that was Star Moonbeam as the catcher. Okay, so bunting actually is probably a bad idea. You can't get them every time. my Darn it. I do still have chatter on. If if Dante Robinson was on their team, I probably would not. No score in this one so far. I'm not gonna turn chatter off unless it starts really, really annoying. Exciting game. <laughs> An exciting game of zero to zero. Yep, that's that's how most of my games go. At least for the first like five innings. That was before the war. What are you talking about? What war? I don't know. I just thought it sounded cool. And the count is 0 and 1. Into the motion. I wish you could give Vinny the Gucci on your team. And that's out. Boom. Didn't even have to throw it to Dimitri. I think this young hitter can get the job done. Do you, Vinny? Do you? He's probably going to be tired out from having to pitch as well. So he's probably going to be real. And he bunted. Actually, considering he was pitching, that's... Considering he was pitching for the first two innings, that's surprisingly fast. Lisa, Lisa is always consistently one of the MVP. She's always the fielding MVP, but she's always consistently like my worst batter, along with Tony. Yeah. What, are you, what are you even doing? As I've said, the only way they're going to get a point is if I either personally screw up or if they get a home run. Other than that, they're not going to score, so I'm not, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not scared or like, oh, I don't know if I'm going to win or not. It's literally just like, I know I'm going to score and beat them. It's just how many innings will it take? All right, Kenny. We're going to try line drive today. Grounder did not work out for you last time because these kids are fast. All right, that's a fairly solid line drive between yes, between their infielders. That was beautiful, Kenny. That was really nicely done. Fielding is top notch. Batting is atrocious. Exactly. On both sides, the fielding is top notch on both sides, and the batting is garbage on both sides as well. All right, Pablo. Pablo is usually the one to get me the point, so. Ready now, fire. Nope. Ball one, runner on first, with nobody out. <laughs> the parents are clapping because someone finally got on base. <laughs> yep. And delivered. A swing. The parents are like, why do we have to be here a again? Ball. Oh yeah, our kids are playing baseball. And that's an out. Darn it, Kenny. Hey. Kenny, it, it, it saddens me to say this, but Pablo might be faster than you. Keisha Phillips. Which would make sense, but... All right, Keisha. Baseball been very, very good to me. None of this open close nonsense. We're doing power squared. That's what I'm talking about. Not a home run, but that's going to land. Nicely done. Keisha go to second. Pablo go to third. Into second with a standing double. Nice job. That kid's pretty fast. Here comes Jorge Garcia. Jorge, can you get a home run? Stand back, peons! 
Jorge could get a home run. Stranger Ready things now. have happened. Look at that, bird. Nope. Hide inside. And there are runners at second and third. One out. I'm debating having Pablo steal home. From the wind up, fire. A swing. Nope. Puck fly. Okay, don't run for that one. Corn for the don't, don't run for that one, guys. Stay there. Because they're gonna kill. Pablo. This is quite a predicament. I'm. Why did Pablo start moving all on his own? Well, I did not tell him to move forward. He started moving. For you almost screwed me up, Pablo. What the heck? Bro? Jorge's going to summer classes after this and doesn't want to get his I've clothes dirty. This pitcher, so I, know what throws are I think it's just Jorge doesn't like getting dirty. All right, we're going to double steal. Unless Here's it's a blatant ball. The delivery. It's... That little blooper sent him running. That was foul. Well, I mean, that's fine if it was foul. Because Pobble probably would have gotten out if it wasn't. Into the motion and the throw. The wing. Oh, come on! No, no, no. Keisha, go back. Keisha, go back. He's caught in a pickle. That's risky because if their, their speed decreases, that's gonna and hurt there are me. Runners at second right. Forget the open. Forget the open. Swing batter, batter. One last ditch effort. The wind up and the pitch. Batter, batter. I'm gonna trust and that's a ball. Was that comes. Of course, that was a Show of hands in the chat. Who thought that that was a ball? That definitely looked like a ball to me. Are really giving them the business, but they're giving it right back. What a game! And of course, we always spitballs. We always consistently get out right before it's the crappy batter. So it's basically giving them a free inning. Oh, boy. We probably won't score until the final inning. That's fine. We just gotta beat them. I don't care how long it takes. You didn't see YouTube is eating strawberry or raspberries. Uh, that's fair. That's fair. You can't just say every batter eats left hooks for breakfast or else it ruins. It no longer means anything if you keep saying it. Socky. I, I love how Lisa can literally just pitch the whole game without ever getting tired. Just give him the heat. That's bad. Do not oh no, if that's a home run. Oh, thank goodness that wasn't a home run. Keisha rocking it. Oh my gosh. Star Moonbeam is fast. That's bad. Okay. Maybe I should not give the heat out if I'm afraid they're going to smack it. Also, Keisha, I'm a little disappointed you didn't catch that. She delivered. The wing. Foul ball. I also have to be careful because Star Moonbeam is very fast. And if at all possible, I really want to. I really want to get her out before she gets to third. If they, if they score, that's going to be bad. That pitch is a tough one for a batter to do anything off of. I'm gonna save my health. Takes the stretch and delivered. The wing. Cool. Get out. All right. Cool. Now that we have two outs, I don't even have to focus on getting Star Moonbeam out. I just have to focus on getting the batter. That's not good. Jorge, get this. Jorge, get this. No, Jorge. Jorge. You. I. I am legit mad at that. I was telling Jorge to move, and he would not move. Oh, I am actually legit angry at that. Jorge, you would have... Jorge fig literally ruined the game. He would not move. I was clicking right next to him, and it's like, Oh, Keisha, have her move, even though she's way farther away. The All-Stars are dimming rapidly out there. Oh, screw you, Benny. Time for a home run. Jacinda, I agree. It's time for a home run. Ready now. Pitch on the way. The swing. A bouncing ball. Darn it, Jacinda. Run faster, please. 
All you can do is try These your kids hardest. are slugs! They're not even trying! I think this young hitter can get the job done. Here goes nothing. Hey, better. Hey, better, better, better. Swing. No, you know what? No, screw that. Power with Lisa. I gotta hope for a home run. She's not getting on base any other way. A bouncing ball. That was <laughs> Everyone was on that side of the field, and of course she's gonna get out because, again, they don't know how to run. Every kid on my team, except for Pete Wheeler, has two sprained ankles all the time. Okay, Slick. All right, Tony, you're an all-star. Get your game on. Go play. That's a foul. Two out. If Tony gets a home run here, Ready now. man, I'll way. be so happy. The wing. And the I mean, if Tony gets on base, I'll be so happy. Okay, that's a solid oh, hit. But, of course, they catch it because they're the magical fielders who never, ever drop anything. And this inning is over. The All-Stars behind... Jorge, so help me if you lost us the game because you wouldn't move your lazy butt two feet, you're off the team. <laughs> no, Dimitri, stay on first. You lack wit. Normally I'm happy with the way the AI controls your fielders, but every once in a while, man, just you cannot make them do what you want. That was really stupid. The one consolidation is that my the strongest part of my team is up next to bat. Pete Wheeler and Pablo Sanchez, who are the two people who've gotten home runs more than once, are both up at bat. And I just need one of them to get that's like my one consolidation. Also, Kenny's not too bad either. Kenny can usually get on. Loops it up, fires across the first, butter fingers that ball. Get out of my way! Quick throw to second. He's safe. Again. Again, the AI is screwing me. I'm not telling Dimitri to move off his butt off of first. He's doing that on his own just to mess with me. Right one. They have a runner on second. One out. Watch me now. Hey. She set the pitch. One on. Another strike. That's right. That's right. Now let's smoke him out. Smoke him out. He almost hit that. That would have been impressive if he had hit that. Even though it's the AI, but. Yeah. All right, Lisa, let's throw another fire. You gotta be some kind of pitcher to make a ball burst into flame. Phenomenal pitch. I'm tired. Give me a sub. One more, Lisa. <laughs> now I'll give you a sub. <laughs> I have to get this guy out. If they get another point, I'm going to lose my mind. All right, Lisa. Um, do I want her as the catcher? Yeah, I do want her as the catcher. All right, Kenny. Throw an elevator. Get him out. Because all we need is one point. And bada bing, bada boom. Did he? That's a foul. You just bunted a foul on two outs. You're out. He should be out. There were two strikes, and he bunted, and it was a foul. Do it again, Kenny. The game is just tr doing everything in its power to make sure I don't win it, isn't it? Boom! Even when she's literally molasses, Lisa still can catch it. Get out of this inning. Halfway through the inning. Oh boy. All right. Pete, Pablo, Kenny. Not in that order. We need a run. Even if we don't get two and win, we just need a run. And we'll be good.
then we can at least buy some extra time. I'm gonna hit a touchdown. Has anyone actually ever beaten hard mode? Oh yeah. Now and delivered. Strike one. Doing power squared with everyone, unless I think closed would be a better option. Actually. The stretch and delivered. Another strike. No. no out. No, Pete. Pete, you're you're like my second to last hope. The wind up. He delivered. That's a That was a ball! I saw that outside the strike zone. Literally, this, this whole game is rigged. The, the referee is rigged. <laughs> My own players are working against me. Kenny, I'm hitting power, because why the heck not? Why the heck not? Okay, that that is a ball. You can't tell me otherwise. Kenny, you've, you've hit home runs before. Not in this season, but let me guess. Okay, good. Honestly, if they walked Kenny, I'd be cool with that. I'd be cool with that. Okay! That's right to him, and he's, of course, going to. And he, oh my gosh, and he moved off first. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, I swear the refs are rigged for the other side, at least sometimes, because there, there have been a lot of, not even just questionable calls, but, like, I know for a fact that was a ball, but you still called it as a strike. All right, Pablo. If there's one thing Pablo is good at. It's performing well under pressure. Well, um, <clears throat> that was a thing. So they have fireballs. Got to be ready for that. When it's raining, there's a dip in the barometric pressure. From the windup, throws it. Swung on, strike two, and the count is 0 and 2. Please, Pablo. We have to go undefeated. Okay, that's not a home run, but maybe... No, they're going to catch that at the back of their head. No, they aren't! Oh, Frab, you a stay. Do not have a cannon. Good. Come on, outrun it. Come on, Kenny, wheel! Kenny! Wheel faster, you lazy bot! <laughs> I feel bad calling a handicapped kid that, but, like, come on. I know you can wheel faster than that. Oh, wait. Oh, he was tired because I threw the special pitch. That, never mind. I feel bad. Sorry, Kenny. You, you did your best. All right, Keisha. It's literally all on you. It is all on you, Keisha. Into the windup and delivered. The swing, another strike. This is not good. This is not good. Takes the stretch and the delivery. The swing. That's bad. That's bad. That's game. That's game. That's our first loss. The All Stars have been whooped. Zero. One. If it's true that you learn more from losing than from winning, these kids could turn out to be quite the young scholars. Until next time. This is Sunny Day and Vinny the Gooch signing off. Dang, way to just verbally eviscerate the team, Vinny. Wow. I'm I'm more annoyed with that loss because that loss was not my fault. That loss was 100% the stupid AI's fault. If I like if I lose cuz I genuinely didn't play well, like I'm fine with it. If I lose just cuz of stupid luck factors, I get really annoyed. <sighs> All right, Bombers beat the Hornets. Yep, they're the second best team. Wombats destroyed the monsters. Wow, the Sox beat the Giants. That's kind of astonishing. Well, we can't keep our 100% win record. That's that's a shame. Not a single run. Man, Pablo Sanchez has the third most home runs. Oh, he's not even number one. Pete Wheeler's had the most number of hits. Kenny's had the... Hey, Kenny got two triples? I don't remember that. Pablo Sanchez has batted in several runs. Pete Wheeler has scored in several runs. Yep, makes sense because he's so fast. Darn it. All right, well, next on the calendar, we play the Sox for the first time. I can't believe we lost that game. 
We shouldn't have lost, but what you gonna do? Sometimes, sometimes Jorge's just a little <laughs> wimp, <laughs> a little goon who <laughs> doesn't do what you want him to. Stop smiling like that, Jorge. You know what you did. You know what you did. <laughs> All right, well, we had our first loss. That's, it's always a tough thing to swallow, but we're still in the lead by a considerable bit. We've won, what was it? We've won nine games, Bombers have won seven. So we're still two games ahead of the Bombers, so we're still probably going to playoffs. Jorge, Jorge, you are now officially the worst person on the team. That's right, Tony has usurped your role. He's better than you. At least Tony hasn't ever cost us the game. Anyhow, you're walking home, Jorge. No, we're not. you're not getting on the, the team bus home. You're walking home. <laughs> Think about what you did. <laughs> Anyhow. That's it for this stream, everybody. That was that was a memorable thing, now, wasn't it? Tune in next time we face off against the Sox next week, which will be Monday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Look forward to that. Uh, hopefully we'll do a bit better. Hope you have a great rest of your uh, evening, and may God bless you wherever you are.